I remember it like it was yesterday, but I wish I could forget the horror, the pain. But most of all, I remember her. <laughs> oh, you horrid, pitiful creature. You can't do any tricks, no skills, not like Coach Pickles over there. Jerabelle, the most beautiful giraffe woman I'd ever seen in my life. She'd come to the circus somewhat recently. Her exceptional height made her a hot commodity, but she wasn't very graceful. That made the ringmaster very angry. It didn't matter to me, though. In my mind, she was perfect. Um, excuse me. Need some help? Th thank you. No one here has ever shown me any kindness. I'm happy to see you're not like the rest of them. You're not like the rest of them either. You're special. Being around her got me through our horrible existence. She gave me hope. Something, someone to live for. Coach Pickles, you're incredible. I wish we could truly be together. We will someday. We'll escape, we'll have long lives in the wild, and be together forever. Good night, Pickles. Good night, Jerabelle. I meant what I said. I was determined to get us out, together. It was going to be difficult, but I thought I could pull it off. One day, Jerabelle had it particularly bad. Idiot! Failure! You useless creature! I ought to have you made into dog food! I was enraged! How could he be so horrible to someone so amazing? I had to step in. I couldn't watch her hurting anymore. Pickles! What's this? Are you two in love? Freaks of nature, I have to separate you. Coach Pickles is more lucrative to have around, so Jirabelle's got to go. Sell the draft to the highest bidder. I don't care where she goes, as long as she's out of here. No! That was the last time I ever saw Jerabelle. I never knew what became of her, as Ban Ban brings in more and more animals to experiment on. Sometimes I hope one of them will be her. At the same time, she doesn't deserve the same fate as me. If I never see her again in this life, all I hope <laughs> is that she is alive and happy. Jerabelle? What? Who are you? How do you know my name? Jerabelle, it's me! Oh my god, I'm so happy you're okay! Do I look okay to you? I missed you so much! <laughs> Jerabelle, I want to get you out of here! How do I know you're not going to hurt me? How do I know you're not like the rest of them? I told you, it's me! It's Coach Pickles! My Pickles? No, you're not him! Don't mock me! My love, my Pickles! He's not a monster like you! Though I have no idea where he is now. The last time I saw him was so long ago. We were imprisoned together at this horrible circus. All we had was each other, and then we were torn apart. You animals are so dramatic. It's like you think you're humans. But we all know animals can't feel. Which is why I don't feel bad about doing this. Have fun at your new home, Jirabelle. Hope you're a fast runner. I was sold off right away to a trophy hunting park. I was in constant danger. I had to run and never stop. I must have run for hours, days even. It was the only way I could stay alive. Sometimes I, I wished I would get caught and put out of my misery. But I held on to this shred of hope. Hope that I might survive and see my pickles again. Must keep going. Must run. Maybe just a little rest. Don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt you. But I am gonna take you with me. Ah, ah, ah. No sense in doing that. Where I'm taking you, you'll be safe. You'll have food, shelter. You'll be cared for. Loved even. Loved? I'd only experienced love once before. I agreed to go with him. Not that I had any other choice. It was certainly strange, but I'd take it over the circus any day. I had no idea how to survive in the wild either. As much as I wanted to go free, I wouldn't mind this kind of captivity. Right this way. I promise. I'll make good use of you. Come now. You 
can stay here until we're fully prepared for you. I had a horrible feeling. Go in. Go in. You had the right idea, dear. Don't worry, you won't be in here for long. Like I told you, I'll make good use of you. Give it a few hours. I'll be back. That was earlier today. I know he'll be back soon, but I don't know what will happen to me. I can help you out. Oh, yeah, right. I know you're a monster, just like him. Well, you're gonna be a monster too if we don't get you out of here fast. I'm what? I always told you we'd break free. Now's our chance. Halt! Leave her be. She is necessary for our plan. We are going to honor her. Bestow upon her our power, just like you. You call this honor? Ben Ben's made us monsters! Speak for yourself. I am a wonderful force of nature. I am a queen. Of a kindergarten. Silence! If you let us transform dear Garibel, she will get to join our clan, our family. After all, she's been here alone for so long. I'm here now. She's not alone. We don't need you. I warned you, Coach Pickles. You won't get away with this. Ah, oh, but we already have. Help! Let go of me! Ben, ben you let go of her! Mm, good luck trying to stop me like that. <laughs> oh, Coach Pickles, don't you see? Love will get you nowhere. You're... Oh. I don't care if you don't remember me, Jerabel. I'm not losing you again! You're here! Jerabel, I'm going to get you out, like I always said! No! Did you really think it would be that easy, Coach Pickles? The honeymoon phase only lasts so long, you know? You won't get away with this! Nice try! Wait! Wait! Give up now, Ban Ban! I'm bigger than you, and stronger than you! <laughs> oh, big tough elephant afraid of a little shocky. Can't get over your fear long enough to save the love of your life. Pathetic. Stay away from my pickles! Ah, you were too late. Jarabelle, I'm so sorry. I was too late. It's okay, Coach Pickles. I understand now. He made you like this. But you're still my Coach Pickles, on the inside. But now we can never be free together. As long as we're together, I'm 